seven year old McMinn County boy. Good evening. I'm Kim Chapman and I'm Calvin Sneed. The Sheriff's Department believes Caden is with his father who has several felony warrants out for his arrest. I should not be standing here doing this. This is a mother's worst nightmare. Hannah Lawrence joins us now live to tell us what happened leading up to now. Hannah. Caden's mother says that he was they were walking into the school this morning when his father jumped out of the truck, scooped Caden up and took off. Ashley Lackey says she moved back to McMinn County from Colorado three weeks ago to get away from her husband. I don't think he would actually honestly like physically hurt my son, but emotionally he is hurting him right now and his brothers. Caden is the oldest of the couple's four boys. They keep saying they miss their brother and they just want him to come home. Lackey says she was dropping them off here at school this morning when her husband intercepted Caden and drove off. My six year old was yelling at his dad that he couldn't take his brother whenever he grabbed him and took him. Lackey didn't want to go into detail, but says what happened this morning stemmed from an incident over the weekend. Sheriff Joe Guy told us it's why Jared Lackey is facing kidnapping and domestic assault charges. Allegedly, Mr. Lackey forces his wife and his children into a vehicle and took them out uh, to a to the Cherokee National Forest and, and then she was able to make her way back and file some charges against him. The one time I finally stand up for myself, now I don't have my son. The sheriff says since the couple is married, there are no criminal charges involved with today's incident. However, police have elevated their search because of the prior charges. He has every right to be with his son and have his son with him. Uh, but because of the arrest warrants and because of the nature of those warrants, some of them having to do with some domestic abuse, uh, we just want to ensure that the child's okay. Caden's mother says Lackey is pressuring her to drop the charges in order to see her son again. It's something she tried, but law enforcement says she can't do. I just want my son to come home. That's all I want. The sheriff says that Lackey doesn't have a prior uh, history with law enforcement. They believe he's driving a charcoal gray Chevy Silverado pickup truck with Colorado tags. Reporting live in McMinn County, Hannah Lawrence, News Channel 9. All right, Hannah, thank you. We go now live to.